Cats, with their enigmatic personalities and subtle body language, often leave us in awe of their emotional depth. While we shower them with love and care, it's easy to overlook the subtle cues that indicate they might be feeling hurt or upset. Cats, like humans, can experience emotional distress, and sometimes, unintentionally, we may be the cause. Here are some ways you might be inadvertently hurting your cat's feelings. Declawing. Declawing is torturous to cats. It would be like cutting off our fingers at the last knuckle, leading to pain and mobility issues. It can even breed a sense of feeling vulnerable or defenseless in your pet. According to the American Veterinary Medical Association, because scratching is an innate cat behavior, declawed cats can suffer from emotional stress when they cannot scratch. It's unrealistic and unkind to try to prevent your feline from their own nature. Lack of mental stimulation. A bored cat means a sad cat. Humans can do a lot of different things with their lives, but your cat is limited to the environment you provide them with. This means that it's up to you to offer your cat things to do. Cats need plenty of mental stimulation to stay healthy and happy. Try playing with them more often or providing some toys that will keep them entertained while you are away at work. If you live in a small apartment, consider getting a second cat. Having a buddy to play and interact with can go a long way in keeping indoor cats stimulated and happy. The two cats will grow together and feel less lonely. Inadequate grooming and hygiene. Cats are meticulous groomers, spending a significant portion of their day cleaning themselves. However, they may require assistance, especially in long-haired breeds or senior cats with mobility issues. Neglecting their grooming needs can result in matting, skin infections, and discomfort, ultimately affecting their emotional well-being. Regular brushing and grooming sessions not only keep them looking their best, but also strengthen the bond between you and your cat. Aggressive Discipline Punishment-based training methods such as yelling, spraying water, or physical punishment can cause fear and anxiety in cats, damaging the trust and bond they share with their owners. Instead of punishing undesirable behaviors, focus on positive reinforcement techniques to encourage good behavior and address issues effectively. Patience, consistency, and understanding are key to fostering a harmonious relationship with your feline companion. Ignoring their signals, Cats communicate through various means, including vocalizations, body language, and behaviors. When we overlook or dismiss their attempts to communicate, it can lead to frustration and feelings of neglect. Tail flicking, flattened ears, or avoiding eye contact are all signs your cat might be trying to tell you something. Ignoring these signals can damage the bond between you and your furry companion. Lack of enrichment. Cats are intelligent and curious creatures that require mental and physical stimulation to stay happy and healthy. A lack of environmental enrichment, such as toys, scratching posts, and interactive playtime can lead to boredom and frustration. Providing a stimulating environment not only prevents behavioral issues, but also fosters a stronger bond between you and your cat. Leaving old food out. Food that has gone bad is no better for your cat than it is for you. It can result in illnesses like food poisoning and problems with the pancreas. Moreover, cats appreciate being served fresh food. They don't like it when the stuff in their bowl sits out too long. It could be part of their finicky personalities, or it could stem from an ancient instinct that protected their ancestors from eating ranced meat. Either way, cats feel appreciated and understood when their families respect their desire for fresh food. Pushing them away. Cats are curious and nosy about their environment. They always need to know what you're doing, and they love being involved. This means your cat might be persistently getting in the way of something, so you might feel compelled to push them away. Before you do, consider if you would like it if someone pushed you away for just wanting to be a part of something that interested you. Instead of pushing your cat away, try gently redirecting them somewhere else, and remember cats want to be close to their humans and also want to be their focal point. If you are constantly rejecting your pet's attempts to be around you, your cat may come down with a serious case of feline blues. Ignoring their fears Cats have a good reason for jumping and hiding whenever they hear a loud or startling sound. Our feline friends can hear sounds around 1.6 octaves higher than humans. 
Common sounds such as the vacuum cleaner, video games, fireworks, balloons, or loud TV can cause stress and anxiety in cats. Flattened ears, lowered tail, arched back, and looking for a place to hide are all signs that your cat is not comfortable in a particular situation. Keep in mind that it is part of a cat's survival instinct to be afraid of loud noises. Make sure you are providing your cat with a calm, relaxed environment that helps them feel safe and secure in your home. Dirty Litter Box Using a dirty bathroom is never a pleasant experience, and it should come as no surprise that your cat feels the same way about their litter box. Cats are very clean animals, and they devote a large portion of their day towards self-grooming. If their litter box is not clean enough, cats may decide to do their business outside of their litter box. Cleaning your cat's litter box every day will make a happy cat and will show it that you understand and respect its needs. Neglecting them. Offering your cat no attention, no affection, no interaction, no conversation, and no playtime can leave your pet depressed. Many people assume that cats are not social animals, but that is far from the truth. Cats benefit from interaction and affection from their humans. Some cats are naturally affectionate, while other felines are more skittish about being held and petted. If you have a skittish cat, leave yourself open to receiving affection from them and return it in kind. Disturbing them while eating. It's natural for cats to be on high alert if there is a lot of noise and activity around them during dinner time. A loud and busy location may cause stress and keeps cats from eating or forces them to eat too quickly. If you're playing loud music, if your kids are playing their new video game at full blast, or if you're yelling from room to room, it will disturb your cat as they eat. A calm and quiet space allows cats to chow down in peace. Overlooking health issues. Cats are masters at hiding pain and discomfort, making it challenging to detect health issues until they become severe. Neglecting regular veterinary checkups and ignoring subtle signs of illness can prolong their suffering and lead to feelings of helplessness and distress. Pay attention to changes in appetite, grooming habits, and energy levels, and seek veterinary care promptly if you notice anything unusual. Invading their privacy. While affection is essential for strengthening the bond with your cat, it's crucial to respect their boundaries and preferences. Forcing physical contact or invading their personal space when they're not in the mood can cause them to feel stressed and anxious. Pay attention to their body language and allow them to initiate interactions on their terms. Shouting. Raised voices will terrify your cat. Feline ears are extra sensitive to loud and high-pitched noises. They can perceive you making these noises as a threat and will begin to avoid them. Remember, shouting at your cat will hurt your bond with your pet and make them associate you with negative emotions. Teasing. Pulling on your cat's tail, blowing in their face, scaring them during deep sleep, and cornering and picking them up against their will are behaviors that confuse and agitate your cat. Remember, what's amusing to you is not always fun for your cat. Scaring your kitty with cucumbers or other objects for entertainment isn't fun for them. One of the basic needs a cat has is to feel safe and secure in your home. It's best to look for other ways to have fun with your pet. Forced friendships. Most cats are reserved around strangers. They're not especially trusting and they want to take introductions at their own speed. When you force your cat to interact with new people, you're essentially disrespecting their feelings. It's always best to let your cat make new friends on their own. Don't force them to interact and tell others to respect their space and their feelings. While our intentions may be pure, it's essential to recognize that our actions can inadvertently hurt our cat's feelings. By paying attention to their needs, respecting their boundaries, and providing a nurturing environment, we can strengthen the bond with our feline friends and ensure their emotional well-being. Let's strive to be more mindful and empathetic caretakers, creating a harmonious and fulfilling life for both ourselves and our beloved cats.